Hey guys, it's me Gary Lee Stanley, your sales guy. How's it going today, guys? And your real uh, real estate sales guy and your insurance sales guy. Uh, what are we going to talk about today? Our subject for today is selling. What is a 440 license, an insurance license? How do you get it? What does it do? And how can you use it in the insurance industry? I just recently had a young lady, I uh, was watching one of my videos that talks about, you know, uh, what type of license to get, a 440, a 220, 215, 214, and so forth. And it was a lot of information in a short video. So what I've done is I'm breaking down the different types of licenses that you can get as an insurance agent that can benefit you. And if you have the capability to get the Mac Daddy, which is the 220, you really do get a chance to do a lot more than a standard 214 or a 440. So let's go forward and let's have a conversation. What is a 440? A 440 license, insurance license, allows you to transact insurance business in an official capacity and not being an agent. Now you're probably going, what? That means you're a good customer service agent. What it means is it gets your foot in the door of an insurance company. There's a lot of companies that sell insurance that need somebody to, to walk people through a process over the phone or if they're working in a business office, like if you have um, all lines uh, license, like say for instance with a 220. There are different companies, you know, you've probably heard of them, Brightway, you probably heard of Geico, you've probably heard State Farm. There's a whole bunch of different ones that sell a lot of insurance products. So what they need is somebody who can walk in who has very limited experience and walk them through a process and they generally want what they call a 440 license at least as a minimum as a minimum because see what happens is, is once you get in there you may like the business and you may want to move up so they will condition it that you get your additional uh, licenses down the road I highly recommend that it's just really important and so let's start with a 440 what 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 kind of what are you going to be doing when you're working with a 440 license well first off you'll be using the phone a lot you'll be talking to customers you'll be giving quotes over the phone you'll be giving quotes in person now remember you're not an agent you have to be under the tutelage of a person who has a uh, who's a representative who's licensed at least to have you know a 220 and in this regard and there could be other other licenses that, that are okay but they have to at least have a general lines agent license and it's really really important and see they're going to supervise you because see it's their license that can get lost <laughs> if something happens so they got to make sure that you know your job and the basics and the fundamentals like i said you're going to give quotes a lot of times you know you're going to learn uh and these are some things you're going to be learning in class too guys first off you got to be at least 18 years old to take this course. You're going to run into having a course that's going to be about a 40-hour course. I took this, and they do have it now online, and you can take it at different colleges, depending on what state you're in. For me, I took this license many years ago at the state college. We had it for two weekends. It was on a Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, uh, six visits. It was a 40-hour class. Now, it was really interesting because, you know, if, if you don't know a bunch about insurance and maybe you're thinking about maybe this might be a good career, it is. It really is because we do have to talk to people about, you know, the situations that they're going to find themselves in. And if they're not protected, they're screwed. So don't look down on yourself if all you've got to start out with is a 440 license. It's very honorable to start with a 440 license, move up, and in this regard, be able to sell. Now remember, you don't, you're going to be working on a salary. That means they're going to pay you an hourly wage, and they're going to expect you to show up and do your job. Okay, And they're going to train you and give you the basics and the fundamentals when you get on the job 
but you really kind of have an overview when you take the course. Now, some of the things that you're going to learn in the course that you're going to be taking is, you know, you're going to be learning about homeowner's insurance. You probably go, okay, that means, hey, man, if you got insurance and something happens to your house, hey, you, the, the family's not screwed because if they don't have any insurance and the house burns down or if there was a storm that destroyed the house, if they didn't have flood insurance, stuff happens. So you being an advocate, which you are, you are a customer service representative for the company that you're going to be representative and you're going to be able to offer quotes on how to get insurance to cover themselves. So it's very, very honorable because think about it. If people don't have insurance and when things happen, they're screwed. They're, I'm just being quite honest with you and the pain that I've seen where people who didn't have insurance, it's devastating. But by you helping, and what you're doing is you're doing an honorable job, you're helping people to protect their homes, their livelihood, and a lot of times, you know, stuff that's so vitally important, their family. And see, in this regard also, you, you're going to be working on dwelling insurance, property a liability, what happens if somebody gets hurt on your property, you got to be covered. And you're going to also be doing like flood insurance. Flood insurance is very important. And by you having the capability of taking this 440 class, you're going to be able to articulate all these things to your customer. Now, you're not going to be perfect at it because you're going to learn it in a really quick manner. And here's the big thing. Here's the big thing I like about when you take the 440 course here in Jacksonville in Florida, uh, there is no uh, state test that you have to take, but you have to take the 40-hour class. You can either do it online or you can do it in a setting where you can get an education at a college. And in your state, you need to find out if that's the case. But I was just online yesterday, and so if anybody's trying to get their license, as long as you take the certification, you probably generally won't have to take any kind of state exam. Now, that's is as of right now, and that's been like that for a long time. And so the things also that you're going to learn is you're going to learn about workers' compensation, when people get hurt on the job. And you can work in a lot of different genres in different places that, that work with you. you got also marine and boilers and crime insurance, auto insurance. People got to have a car. And so there's, auto, there's all these different companies that are selling that insurance. So you've got to be able to have a conversation. You're going to learn about personal insurance. You're going to under, understand about umbrellas. And I know this sounds like a bunch of weird stuff, but these are the fundamentals and the basics of the courses that you're getting ready to take. Also concepts are, con you know, you're going to learn about contracts, how to have a conversation, how to write the paperwork up, what's legal, what's not, ethics. You got to be ethical because I'm going to tell you what, if you're not, you're going to get in trouble. And you're going to have to learn about errors of omission, things that, that may not be right. You got to talk about risk. You're going to be learning about risk management and a lot of other processes. Now, you'll probably say, woo, that's a lot of stuff just to get a 440 license. Each of the licenses that you're going to get, you've got a lot of stuff that you have to learn. There's the fundamentals. It just makes sense. And I'm just saying that if you want to get into the insurance business, it's really cool. See, it's a career. It's an opportunity. A lot of courses, I mean, a lot of, if you want to go to like a lot of high-end jobs and stuff, they want you to have like a four-year college degree. Well, hey guys, a 40 hour class and that's it to get you started. Woohoo! That's pretty good. And you got a course that you take that's less than 500 bucks. Have you ever looked at how much it costs to take classes in college just to learn how to and do write on writing English, uh, English class or a math class? You're looking at about 500 to almost two thousand dollars a semester. Just I mean, just for a, just a couple of classes. So by getting this license, it affords you the opportunity to see if you like the insurance business, fill it out, see if that's what you want to do. Because see, the companies, they buy in you and they will give you an opportunity, but without a 440, they ain't gonna give you no, no chance to work in, in no insurance place. They're just not gonna do it. Now, the key to success in this regard is when you take your course and everything, you get your you get your certification. Woohoo! That's a great day. You get your little certification. 
Now, hopefully you've been talking to some companies because, see, companies will buy for you as long as they know that you're going to be going to get that course. They'll sign you up sometimes and let you come to work for them, but until you have that 440 license, they ain't going to let you work. So also, what do you need to have to become uh, a 440 agent? Uh, what you got to do is you got to be at least 18 years old. Uh, and what you're going to do is you're going to have your background checked. And you, hopefully you're not doing anything wrong because they do do a background check and they also do a fingerprint. You're probably asking, well, how much is all that going to cost? Probably around with everything between two and four or five hundred dollars. And you're probably saying, oh, that's a lot of money. In the big scheme of things, it's a very minute little bit of money. Because you can make up to, I don't know, $15 an hour some places. That's 600 bucks a week. Just talking to people about process and having opportunities to talk to them about why they should get insurance and give them quotes. That's pretty damn good. Now, remember, this isn't a commission position. So that means you're going to be working on a salary. You're going to be working on an hourly basis. And again, a lot of these companies will come after you and ask that you try to get to the next level. I've had some people I knew, uh, they gave them like a six months to, to, to study and all that. And uh, I'll be quite honest with you, I was one of those people and I didn't study for that six months. And I just did the work and, I, and so forth. And these people uh, and myself, um, they that one day they come to you and say, hey, it's time for you to go ahead and take your test for that next level. And I wasn't prepared, and some of these other people I knew weren't prepared either. So they weren't able to stay within the insurance the industry. But see, that's okay. See, I ended up getting my license. I sell life insurance, and I sell annuities, and I also make sure that people, if they need insurance, I help them through a process. Because, see, it's important, mortgage insurance. People buy homes and so forth, and they need somebody to be able to walk them through a process. Because people die every single day. And if you own a home and you don't have any insurance, especially if your significant other dies, it, it's like you got to move out. And then you're screwed. I'm just saying. But let's get back on target. The 440 license does give you the capability, remember, to offer quotes. You do have to work with a general lines agent. That means probably a 220, or and in this regard, that is the the, the license that a lot of people shoot for because they might want to sell you know car insurance. And like I said, they might want to sell insurance about their home insurance. There's a lot of reputable companies that would love to have you come work for them. You know, my name is Gary Lee Staley, your insurance sales guy, your real estate sales guy, and just in general, your all-out sales guy. And I love everything there is to do with, um, with insurance and with sales. And I hope you got a little bit out of this. Uh, so if you have any questions or concern, if you need some help, just give me a call at 904 six six two eight nine three three and if you know anybody who might need some insurance or may want to buy a house <laughs> here in the northeast florida area just ask for gary lee stanley and i'll be more than glad to walk them through a process you're important and you matter so i hope you got something out of this remember a 440 license is an awesome license it is a customer service license it gets you in the door so if you're planning on sticking and staying, you might want to get more. And, you know, like I said, I, I lost an opportunity not too long ago because I only had a 214 license. They wanted a 215. But if I would have had that 440 license still up to date, I would have been able to walk right in there and they would have given me the grace and I could have worked on my other stuff. So what I'm sharing with you is things that are practical experience from my own life. And remember, guys, you can do anything you want to. The subject for today is what is a 440 license, how do I get it, and what is it used for? Now you know, so go out there and get you a 440 license, get yourself started, and we're proud of you. It's important and you matter. Get yourself a license and don't let that little bit of money ruin. Save up for it, little nickels and dimes. I mean, for me, it took me probably a couple of months when I first got started to be able to put that little bit of money away but I had a goal. So if you have a goal and you want to be an insurance person and you want to get in the field and you want to make some really, really good money, go ahead and save your little pennies and pay it off and get started. Remember, this is a 440 license. This will get you in the door. And I promise you, once you get in the door, you're going to say, dang, I need to get a bigger insurance license. But now I've got the fundamentals and the knowledge to know what to do. 
So go out there and sell something. Have a wonderful day. And remember, your 440 license, yeah, get that. You got this. You can do it. I got you back. All right.